Dear learners, welcome to the course Antennas and Microwave Engineering. In this video, we will discuss about the impact diode. The word impact it stands for impact ionization avalanche transit type. These diodes employ impact ionization and transit time properties of some conductor structure to produce negative resistance at microwave frequency. Generally, the impact diode exhibits negative resistance. Negative resistance arises from two delays such as avalanche delay and transit time delay. Avalanche delay is caused by finite build-up time of avalanche current. The transit time delay due to the finite time taken by the carriers to cross the drift ridge. Here. These two are important delays that causes negative resistance property. When these two delays add up to 180 degree, the diode electronic resistance becomes negative. Corresponding to that frequency, ionization events which results in large multiplication of current or avalanche breakdown occurs. The multiplied whole current exists to the left of avalanche zone or in the P region and the multiplied electron current exists to the right or in the end region. By proper selection of the doping levels and the thickness of the P and the N region, the transit time delay associated with the holes and electrons moving across the drift region will generate RF frequency in a desired frequency band. So, from the above discussion, we conclude that impact operation, two effects are important. One is impact ionization, another one is slow transit velocities. There are three typical silicon impact diodes. These are one-sided abrupt PN junction, linearly graded PN junction, another one is PIN diode or pin diode. So, this figure represents various types of impact diodes with that doping profile. Impact diodes have many forms. It may be N plus PIP plus or P plus NIN plus red devices, P plus NP plus abrupt junction and P plus IN plus diode together with that doping profiles. Such diodes can be manufactured from germanium, silicon, gallium arsenide or indium phosphide. However, gallium arsenide provides the highest efficiency, highest operating frequency and least noise figure. But fabrication process is more difficult and is, and is more expensive than silicon. When a Large reverse bias voltage is supplied. Some electrons and holes in the region of thick field gain enough energy, and this may them impact and load electrons or ionize atoms in the crystal lattice. Thus, an impact ionization mechanism creates an electron hole path. The electrons and holes thus created are accelerated by the field in the opposite direction and can cause additional impact. Generally, the field applied to the impact diode is about 5 kV per centimeter. The total field across the diode is sum of RF AC voltage superimposed on high DC voltage. When a PN junction is reverse biased in the depletion layer, avalanche breakdown takes place. Avalanche current lags the applied field by 5 by 2 radians. The carriers constituting the avalanche current will drift to the respective electrodes that is hole to negative electrode and electrons to positive electrode. The distance travelled by various carriers are not equal but the additional phase shift caused by the drift of carriers makes the carriers to create a negative resistance. So, this figure illustrates the variation of negative resistance with the transit angle.
This graph shows that the maximum resistance is offered at theta is equal to pi. Above pi radians, the resistance decreases rapidly. The operating frequency around the pi transit angle f is equal to 1 by 2 tau. F is equal to Vd by 2L. Where tau is the transit time, Vd is the drift velocity and L is the drift length in meter. Maximum output power is given by Pm is equal to Im Vm that is current into voltage. Where Pm is equal to maximum output power is Em squared epsilon s Vd A. Where Em is the maximum electric field, Vd is the drift velocity, A is cross sectional area and epsilon is a semiconductor permittivity. The efficiency of impact diode is given by eta is equal to the ratio of the PAC to the PDC. This figure illustrates the equivalent circuit for impact diode. The negative resistance RD is in series with the reactance XD. The package is described by a series inductance LP and a shunt capacitance CP. The value of LP is changed by the microwave circuit surrounding the diode. Here I have listed some of the performance characteristics of impact diode. Efficiency is generally 30%. In practically, it is less than 30%. For silicon diode, efficiency is 15%. For gallium arsenide, efficiency is 23%. Frequency ranges from 1 to 300 GHz. Maximum output power for single diode is 5 watts in X band to 0.5 watts at 30 GHz. Several diodes combined, the output power will be 40 watts at X band. Pulsed power is 4 kW. These are the general performance characteristics of impact diode. Impact diode is potentially reliable and compact, inexpensive, moderate efficient microwave power sources. These are some of the advantages of impact diode. Disadvantages are very low efficiency. Generally, it provides less than 30% efficiency. It is one of the major disadvantages of impact diode. It is very noisy because the avalanche is a noisy process. Noise figure for impact diode being 30 dB or not as good as klystron or gun diode or TWT amplifier. And also tuning rate is not as good as gun diodes and amplifiers. These are general disadvantages of impact diode. Here I have mentioned some of the applications of impact diode. Impact diodes are generally used in microwave generators, negative resistance amplifiers, parametric amplifier pumps, modulated output oscillators, receiver local oscillators. High Q impact are generally used in intrusion alarm network, police radar and low power transmitter. Low Q impact diodes are useful in FM telecommunication transmitter and CW Doppler radar transmitter. I hope you would understand the topic impact diode. Thank you.